hello beautiful people welcome back to my youtube channel this is real news tv if this is your first time watching my video please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also turn on the notification button and if you have subscribed to my youtube channel thank you so much may god bless you our today's um, gist is on yalaji and the palace of oni of ife yeah Yalaji has showcased her grown-up daughter. Yeah, she's quite beautiful. Yeah, exactly. So, um, I think she just finished her schooling. Yeah, because um, she showed up her graduation uh, pictures as well. So, I never knew that Yalaji has a daughter that is that has grown so much. Yeah, because why I said so? Because of the utterances she always use or the attitude she always give um, Queen Naomi. Because um, Queen Naomi and her daughter should be of um, the same, almost the same age. Or Queen Naomi might be a little bit older than her. But that, that's notwithstanding. Because she, at least she has an experience of being a mother. And um, she knows what it takes to, to, um, to train a child. So um, rumors have been going around. I mean, my people, I have to bring this gist for you guys this morning. Because the way I... Get my own. That is the way I table it on this channel. Rumors have been going on that Yalaji has been gunning for her daughter to be the next queen. She has all those things she's doing, all those backbiting towards Queen Naomi, all those um, um, wicked utterances, all those uh, body language she gives. It is for her daughter. She's doing it for her daughter to become the next Olori of Oni of Ife. And I wonder, and I wonder again, because this lady, her daughter, she grew up in, I think she went to school abroad. So after all your um, uh, foreign knowledge, you still want to come back and become the queen. Or your mother is um, gunning you to become a queen. Then this is the lady. She's so beautiful. I am. I did not say that. I am sure. I'm just saying this is what I. The information I got from bloggers, and I always bring it here so that I will. Um, we will talk about it, or if um if it is not true, we know how to discuss about it because my channel is about interactive purposes. So I am getting convinced. Yes, I must say I am getting convinced because the way Yalaji is treating uh, or treated uh, Queen Naomi because she's uh, always overshadowing her. Yes, Yalaji's position, she, she doesn't even know her position anymore. She has overstepped her boundary. Yalaji is supposed to be a chief, one of the chiefs in the palace. But she's always uh, beside the king, always overshadowing everybody. Even Queen Naomi cannot even come and be with her husband. Queen Naomi cannot, can, has to squeeze herself to stay with her husband. If you see Yalaji and Oni of Ife, you will mistake uh, Yalaji to be the queen and uh, Queen Naomi to be just a helper. Because Yalaji is always there, overshadowing everything. You know, even on the king's uh, birthday. She couldn't even when the the king the king's birthday sorry the, she couldn't even allow the king to to uh, see his wife. She's always there, you know, dragging, trying to sh 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 cover everywhere. And uh, uh, some rumors were like Yalaji and uh, Oniofife. They are doing something. They are doing something because this attitude is not normal. And now that she showcased her daughter, people now said, okay, so this is the road that this woman has been clearing all this while. This is the pathway she has been making. All those uh, covering of body, this is it. This is her plan all this while. That is why Queen Naomi is being condemned. Left, right, and center. You know, uh, if they don't have any, any other thing to say, they will say that she did not go to school. She did not go to school. And if this rumor is true, your daughter that went to school upon all the foreign knowledge, all the schooling abroad, she still wants to come back and become uh, not even the fifth wife, maybe the seventh wife, self, or the tenth concubine. 
Some people see education as if it is it is the all and all. Let me tell you something. Education doesn't even work in Nigeria. Education does not work in Nigeria. Going to school is a scam in Nigeria because even people that went to school, they have turned educated illiterate. Yes. Even outside the country, country like Germany, young ones, they don't even go to school. Most Majority of them don't even have a certificate that we Africans have. You see an average African person with master's de degree. In Western world, they don't have it. You will, be, before they can get first degree, you, it is always difficult. Half of them don't like, don't go to school, but they use their head. Look at how their society is. So you're telling me that Queen Naomi did not go to school. That is why she's not fit in the society. She did not go to school, but the king find favor in her, find beauty in her. So Yalaji has been one of the people that, that make the palace uncomfortable for um, Queen Naomi. And I was shocked when I saw the picture of her daughter that so this woman has a daughter that is groomed. And she's treating somebody else's daughter like this in her husband's house. That one they scatter my brain pass. How can somebody anyway? Me, me, I think Queen Naomi is too gentle, or that is because she wants to be a queen. You know, a queen is not supposed to be rash. They said sometimes the kingdom of God suffered violence. But it is only the violent person that will take it by force. Sometimes you need to show some people grace so that they'll know that ah, this person is not an Okbunu. This person is not a fool. Queen Naomi has been so soft to everybody. That is why all of them use her as a stepping carpet. She couldn't take it because of her gentleness. She had to pack alone and leave the palace. Even as she left the palace, too, she knows to get peace. Her name is on everybody's lips. So that time she came to say that uh, Queen uh, uh, Fife should bring uh, Queen Naomi back. It is ska, 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 stam. It is just so that she would just uh, say something. She didn't even mean it. So this is what I saw my people and I said, I must share it with my family here. I must share it with my, with, with, with my beautiful viewers. So my beautiful viewers, if you have anything to say or have to this um, video, please, I would like to see it on your comment section because you guys are, are always, I like, the inter I, I, I like the interaction on my, on my comment section. You guys are wonderful. If I, if I can have a chance to give all of you a hug. I will do that. Thank you guys so much. I will see you in my next video. And please don't forget to like, share, and comment. And also, subscription. And when you subscribe, don't forget that bell. That bell is very important too. Because if you don't press that bell, if you don't click on that bell, when I post new videos, new gist like this, you will not be notified. And if you are not notified, how will you see the video? Please not only subscribe, but click on that on that bell so that whenever I post new videos, you will be the first to be notified. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.